morning from Mexico. I had my leg wrapped up because I accidentally backed into my scooter's exhaust. I had a busy day, so I jumped out of bed and went through this maze of a closet into the bathroom and had a shower. Then I hopped on my friend's scooter and we went on a rescue mission because the day before, I got a flat tire on mine. It was pouring rain when it happened though, so we waited for the next morning to deal with it and I ended up having to pay for a new tire. Then we walked down the busiest street and got some lunch, hopped in a taxi and made it to explore. Unfortunately, I couldn't bring my camera because I didn't have a strap, so this is the only video I got. When we got back, I went up to the rooftop of our place because I wanted to fly my drone and look at this amazing cinematic shot I got. Opa! Opa! I have no clue what that word means, but they kept yelling it. This place has got to be my favorite restaurant here. It just keeps getting crazier and crazier as the night goes on. And everybody gets on their chairs and starts waving around their napkins, and then we all smash plates. After the plate smashing, we ended off the night on this rooftop with some music. Bye, Michael. Bye, Jeffrey. Bye, Ava. Thanks for the year, Mrs. Thomas. You could have taught me better, but I passed, so it doesn't matter. <sighs> no more Lou Davidson! Bastards. Hey, I forgot to introduce you to my little brother. He's gonna be in your class next year, and he's just like me. <gasps>
I just sent you a picture. Oh, I forgot about him. Yeah, so back to what I was saying. If you don't give me $100,000 by tomorrow, your son will die. What the? <laughs> I told you. Why couldn't the blonde dial 911? Why? Because she couldn't find 11. <laughs> Guys, I've had enough of these blonde jokes. I want to tell you that this blonde went home last night and did something I bet none of you guys can do. I memorized the capital of every state. Oh, did you now? I find that very hard to believe. What's the capital of California? <laughs> Easy. C. <laughs> Well, I better get going. I'll come visit again tomorrow, okay? Don't worry, darling. You won't have to deal with this for much longer. Bye. Hey, officer. You need to give my husband a break from working so hard. He's exhausted. <laughs> Are you kidding? All he does is eat, sleep, and stays in his cell. Don't lie to me. He told me he's been digging a tunnel for months. <gasps> Do you know what time it is? Uh, it's eight o'clock. Thank you, have a great night. <sighs> what? Hey, do you happen to know what time it is? <sighs> it's 8.15. Thanks, have a good one. <sighs> That's it. What? I don't know what time it is. I know. That's why I knocked. It's 8.27. Watch this. <laughs> Think again. Oh, hey man. Thanks for that investment tip last month. I invested all my savings into it. Really? Yeah, you got me so excited on it that I even sold my house and moved back in with my parents so I could invest even more money into it. Well, when I told you about that, I wasn't recommending it. What do you mean? You did say it made you a millionaire, right? Yes, but I used to be a billionaire. Oh my gosh, there's a bear! Oh no, we're gonna die! What are you doing? That's not gonna help you outrun the bear, you know. Yeah, I know. I don't have to outrun the bear. I just have to outrun you. Jesse? Jesse, are you okay? 911, what's your emergency? My friend is dead, what do I do? Calm down, sir, I can help. First, let's make sure he's actually dead. Oh 
okay. Now what?